What's up YouTube? Zero here and today I'm going to be doing a hunter build in Destiny 2 called the Devil's Reject. If you haven't been able to infer already, this is in tribute to the movie The Devil's Rejects. I'm going to be coming out with different tribute builds to different movies and TV shows, so be on the lookout for those. My first one is The Devil's Rejects, not only because this is a classic, but it is also one of my personal favorite movies. Now, this build is either going to be amazing or, well, it may be a clown build. I, I don't know yet, but let's get into it and see what happens. What's the matter, kid? Don't you like clowns? Why? Don't we make you laugh? Aren't we fucking funny? Well, Captain Spaulding, I, I definitely like clowns. I, I wasn't inferring. Any, let's just get into the build. So we have the Gunslinger, and I'm going with the Incendiary Grenade, which lights enemies on fire. I'm going with the Gambler Dodge, which dodging near enemies is going to get me my throwing knife back, and whichever jump you want. The main thing is way of a thousand cuts. Well, this is a Devil's Reject build. We better be going with the Better Devils as our primary gun, and the Devil's Ruin as our secondary gun. Line in the Sand as our heavy and i'm going to talk about that in a little bit and then as our allocation you really want that mobility as high as possible i'm really sorry if you're ocd i only got to 97 i was trying for the 100 but couldn't exactly get there strength is the second main stat to get that melee back quickly and the third stat is recovery and obviously of course i gotta put the righteous armor on but the main important thing is the bombardiers when you dodge, you leave a bomb in your wake. But of course, we are the Devil's Reject. We want to have the Righteous Armor equipped, and we have to make it red and black. I am the Devil, and I am here to do the Devil's work. And of course, we are going to be doing the Devil's work with this build. We have the better Devils, we have the Devil's Ruin, but those are not the bread and butter of this build. You know why we've equipped them. The better Devil's Devil's Ruin, that's obvious. We're talking about ourselves being a Devil's Reject or doing the Devil's work. But let's talk about the abilities. That's our main focus on this build. In the Devil's Rejects, they enjoy cutting people up. They enjoy inflicting pain. And so we have an ability with our throwing knife where we are going to be killing enemies with our throwing knife who are lit on fire by our incendiary grenade, and we are going to be getting our throwing knife back almost constantly. If for whatever reason we are not getting our throwing knife back because we miss or we're doing damage to a heavy enemy, then we have our dodge, which is going to get our throwing knife back. And as you can see, I am almost constantly getting that throwing knife back. And then on top of that, I have my dodge. Not only is my dodge supplementing that throwing knife, but I am also leaving a bomb in my wake. I am doing mass destruction, and that's what the Devil's Rejects do. They chop people up, they inflict pain. And let's go back to the guns, actually. We're not only going to be inflicting pain on our enemies, we're also going to be inflicting pain on ourselves because why not? Obviously, right now in Destiny 2, these are not the best guns in the game, but we're going to be using them. So we're going to take a little bit longer to kill enemies if we decide to use our guns than we could if we were choosing a little bit better guns. But mimicking a Devil's Rejects build, we spare no expense. So of course we have to go with the better Devils and the Devil's Ruin. Now you may be asking yourself, well, why lying in the sand? That doesn't have devil in the name, and it's just, I mean, line in the sand. Well, spoiler alert for anyone who doesn't want to know the ending of Devil's Rejects. I'll give you a second to tune out now. All right, if you are still here, you are okay with this spoiler. But at the end of Devil's Rejects, the three from hell, Captain Spaulding, Otis, and Firefly, baby girl, run at the cops. The cops made a line, so the... Three from Hell could not get out of town, and that is your line in the sand. And the three from Hell just make a complete charge at them. So that is our line in the sand. 
And that really completes our Devil's Rejects build. Obviously, you heard Otis. We're the devil and we're here to do the devil's work. So obviously, we need the righteous armor on. That only makes sense. So we went with the righteous armor and it has to be red and black. So if y'all want to see a specific movie or TV show, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know which one you want done. Uh, maybe not Dora because I have no idea what swiper no swiping means. I'm not sure really how I would do the build on that. <laughs> do I stutter, bitch? So let's try to stay away from Dora, but I mean, if y'all really want to see Dora, okay, fine, I will get it done. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my Devil's Reject build. If you did, feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more Destiny 2 content, and especially these movies slash TV shows builds. I'm going to be coming out with a bunch more in the future. So be on the lookout for those. Again, if you do have a recommendation or one you'd like to see, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section to let me know. Well, until next time, peace.